Good morning. This is your world heavyweight champion, John Halini here today. And it is morning out, as you can tell. I would like to tell you all something this that I am going to do the WWE March 3rd edition of Raw results. Here it goes. I'm going to start it. Okay. The opening of the show, we have Paul Heyman come out to CM Punk's entrance. I was so excited. I thought we'll see Punk's return. I was like, CM Punk, CM Punk, CM Punk's back. But no, don't be this had to go mess that up. But as you can tell, Paul Heyman did a pipe bomb and said that Punk wasn't there. And I knew from the very beginning that I thought he was, but I just kept cheering CM Punk at the TV all night, and I thought he will be there. So then we have Brock Lesnar coming down and says that he believes in a heart that, that the Undertaker is scared of him. Lesnar says the man has tried to conquer the streak, including Shawn Michaels, Triple H, and CM Punk. He calls them failures and says the streak will get conquered. Mark Henry comes out and attacks Lesnar. Brock Lesnar throws him into the steps and then hits him in the face with the steel steps. Lesnar hits the F5 onto Henry through the announcer's table. Then we have the New Age Outlaws versus the Usos for the Tag Team Champions. The match starts with Road Dog hitting a few clotheslines, of course, and Jimmy Uso sends him to the corner and hits a kick in the stomach. Road Dog sends Jimmy to the outside, as we heard. Commercial, it was a commercial break, of course. And then we have. He's back from commercial, and Jimmy is hitting a spinning heel kick, and Jay gets into the action. Jay hits Road Dog in the face to the outside. Simone Jop, and then goes the Rakishi stink face, which I laughed about it. Jimmy gets a two count on to Billy. Jimmy hits a kick to Road Dog face, reveals pump handle slam in hit in onto Jimmy Gun, sets up for a form for us easier. But Jimmy tags his brother and like tags, splashes onto Road Dog. Jay gets the tag and hits a super kick splash from the rope for the win. The Usos are the new tag team champions. I want you all in the comments to say, when I say Oos, you say O. Oh. Oos! That will be your guys' part to say the O. Oh. And the winner of the Usos. So I was very happy about that. Now we have Big E versus Cesaro. Cesaro is a beast, let me tell you all that. Well, Jack Swire comes into the ring and, and power bombs and, dis, and gets Cesaro disqualified. I don't know, guys. What do you think? Are we going to see a real Americans break up? I'm not quite sure about this, but they they big big ending while the Swire looks from the outside. Of course, that's going to be something. Well, the winner, Big E, Viva Disqualification. Now next you have the Shield vs. Wild Man. Excellent, excellent match. The Shield vs. Wild 2. This was amazing. And then the, even the winner is the Shield wins. And I was, I was very happy that the Shield won. We have Renee talking backstage to, to Batista. She asked him about Dan Bryan and says that the yes movement is very dumb. And he says Dan Bryan will never be the guys like him in all of his fantasy. He says that in the fact that the fans have to deal with it. Santino Merle and Emma now I'm doing Santino Merle and Emma versus my name is Summary. And of course I didn't really care about that match so here it goes. Santino and Emma win together as a team. Now we have Sheamus versus Christian. Even I believe that she, Christian should be champion again before his time is up. But why don't they never let Sheamus always win. And of course, the winner was Sheamus, but I just think that Christian should win. It's just really sad. Oh, and also, after the commercial backstage, Christian really attacks Sheamus. He hits him with the light in the stomach. Oh, man. The Bell Twins vs. Akasan and Alicia Fox. The winner are the Bell Twins. Now, the, now, Dale Bryan comes out and all the crowds are doing, yes, yes, yes. And the crowd chants CM Punk, CM Punk. And Dale Bryan says that he will leave the ring until Batista comes down to fight or until Triple H. Down and Triple H just comes out to the behold, the kings, the king of kings. Of course, he comes out and says the, the Triple H, which I laughed about that promo. It was really funny. 
But I just think that uh, I don't want to see Triple H versus Daniel Bryan at WrestleMania. I want to see Daniel Bryan go after the belt. This is ridiculous. Or add Punk into the main event and make it be a three-way. Alberto uh, Dream versus Dolph Ziggler with Aaron Paul. It was very funny. I laughed, I laughed hysterical, and Aaron Paul got on top of the thing and started to distract it. Alberto Del Rio and the winner, of course, was Dolph Ziggler. Now, Paul Bearer is inducted into the Hall of Fame, which I really like. Paul Bearer is inducted into the Hall of Fame, and I like that Paul Bearer is inducted, and it's going to be an interesting match, so can't wait for that. Now, we have Big E versus Jack Swagger. The bell rings, and Sarge hits a neutralizer for the disqualification. Swagger and Sarge yell at one another, and I thought we were going to see Cesaro and Swagger split up, but Zay caught to get something he says, no, no, hug it out, hug it out. I laughed hysterical this, but Big E is the winner. And he says that we, the people, I want you all in the comments to say, we, the people. Now we have John Cena comes out and thanks the fans for a warm Chicago welcome. John Cena says he respects the city of Chicago and that he always hears the fans and will always know the fans are honest and loud. <laughs> Man, Cena always doing all this stuff. He says that he has given the last 12 years of his life to the WWE. He says that he his career started here in 2002 and that he is doing the same thing now and that the old the, that he did back then. The Wyatt family interrupts Bray Wyatt. He says that the championship man starts to slow down and he is looking for the next finish line. Wyatt talks about Cena reality and says, his mercy is calling him by the name. Bray Wyatt says that he is going to put John Cena down. He says that he is going to take everything away from John Cena. Okay, now here we go. Alexander Ruff with Lana comes out and cuts a promo, which I thought that was pretty stupid. But I believe in that Alexander Ruff. I think he's going to make a great debut match. I keep hearing after WrestleMania. That he's going to show up on Raw and make his debut. Can't wait for that match. I hope he has a good competitive match. I just don't know what's going to happen. Now it's time for the main event. Batista versus Daniel Bryan. And I thought CM Punk was going to come back at the main event. Which I didn't like. But what can you say? WWE obviously screwed us over with this one. Bryan... Okay, now we have Brian doing the knee on to Batista. Batista kicks him in the shoulder. Brian gets clotheslined by Batista, and the animals in control. We head, they head to commercial break, of course. So then we come back on. Brian gets his offense going and hits a running drop kick into the corner twice. Brian hits a suicide dive to the outside. Batista, multiple kicks to Batista, gives Brian a two count, Batista throws Brian into the steel steps, and throws Randy Wharton come into the ring, and Brian hits a running knee, he takes out Kane, Brian's lying waste to everybody, Batista hits a spear onto Daniel Bryan, Triple H comes down and separates Kane from Brian. Brian kicks Triple H and when he says, I'm tired of fantasy crap. I like the circle when he just kicks him like that. Triple H in the face. Batista hits a Batista bomb onto down Brian. Triple H hits a pedigree onto Brian. And Stephanie does the yes chance that ends the WWE Raw. Well, guys, I want you all to think of my, my prediction, what, what, what happened here. It was very Darrell. I'll give it on the scale from 8 to 10. Not so very good without CM Punk, but I want Punk back. I hope he comes back Punk. I want Punk back, and I hope he does come back, because you know why? We want Punk. I want you on this video to say, we want Punk, hashtag, we want Punk. That's what I want you guys to do. So, guys, please like this video, leave a comment, and subscribe. More from John Pellini. I do wrestling slideshows and daily videos now. So please like this video, leave a comment, and subscribe for more. We'll catch you all later. This is John Pellini signing.
Uh, see you all later from your world, world, world heavyweight champion, John. Huh, I just love doing that.